today's video. Today I'm preparing a baking soda sandwich. I'm gonna show you guys. So I have this little tiny peanut butter sandwich and it was left over from somebody's toast this morning. I like to do this every once in a while where I put a little bit, that might be too much. Wait, mom, can dogs have peanuts? Yeah. I like to give Daisy, can I give it to her? I like to give Daisy a uh, peanut butter baking soda sandwich every once in a while. And the reason I do it is because it lowers her alkalinity level. Because as you guys know, Dalmatians are subject. <laughs> as you guys know, Dalmatians are subject or very prone to bladder infections because of diet carry things that they have and so uh, Daisy's never had a problem and knock on wood she's been fabulous we've known about the issue that can plague Dalmatians from the start her breeder made us sign like all these waivers and we had to like educate ourselves on it before we could even bring her home so uh, one way to help prevent any kind of issue is to lower her alkalinity level and clearly she is back for more <laughs> So we know that she likes it and it just kind of is like a safeguard, like not even a safeguard, but it's something that we do. It's something that we do that makes us feel safer, lowers the risk slightly, and not that we've ever had a problem, but I want to keep it that way too. So that's just something that we do. We give her, and I almost feel like it would have benefited so many people too, to have like a little bit of baking soda in our life or even lemon, add lemon to your water and stuff because a lot of people, especially who have like high sugar diets, which is common, um, could benefit from that. But anyway, that is just a tip and a trick that we do with our Dalmatian that maybe you want to do with your Dalmatian or maybe you don't and that's okay. Uh, I want to show you guys something. All right, show them. Okay, so this is Fred. He has a pink eye and a blue eye and he has his leash, which he's tied up to a wagon right now. And he has his collar on and he's my little snowman. <laughs> Tried to scare you. Hi, big boys. They don't I gotta it, go. It's pretty warm. I gotta go with Gabby first. Yeah, it's nice out, you oh, guys. You have to get Tino. Yeah, I have to go get the bags first. I'll be right back for you. Oh, look at they already eat almost all that hay. It's like he knows she was coming for him. Hi, handsome. It's been a few days, huh? All right, we got Gray Finn. Gray Finn? It was a bit of a feat, but we got him. Yeah. He drags me, guys. He drags me everywhere. He drags me. <laughs> he started off all calm, and then he started getting. I dragged. also have our bags Back for grain. Up. He's a little spicy. Go ahead, you're going out. Go out with him. Look how big he looks, you guys. He's huge. He's huge. I'm not going Look, they've disappeared. We came back for the horses and they're gone. Oh, there you are. Aww. Hello. We bought a better neck for you, Finn. Come on. Holy heck. I just had the walk of my life. Chino's so big, so big. And when he gets nervous, he doesn't think like any regular old horse. And he did not like walking behind Finn. Oh man, I thought he was gonna drag me. <laughs> it almost came to it. I had to make him back up and listen to me. So Sam is making, setting up a big grain station here. He's got all the grain. We should have brought another bag, eh? Get later. Oh, it's in the car? Sam doing his dad things. <coughs> his dad business. I need to make like a video of what we give our horses because we love the fact that we can make our own grain bags and put whatever supplements we want in it, change it up whenever we want to, like kind of still make all the decisions about their food, but also make it easier for our barn who like goes out of their way to make sure our horses have everything they need. And they're so accommodating, so. Oh, man, I'm tired. Chino almost dragged me. This is gonna be Finn's new neck. <laughs> because we don't want him to be wearing pink. Not that boys can't wear pink. 
He can wear whatever color he wants, but one crime against society is clashing. Defend ties as a horse. He invented what? He, whatever you said, as a Identifies horse. as a? Horse. Actually, I don't think he does. I think he identifies as, Tommy. as a person. No. Yeah, maybe. No, he's a horse because. He's a, a pony. He identifies as a horse. He's a horse. identifies as a pony. He's he a is a pony. pony. He identifies by a pony because he can be whatever he wants. Yeah. You're going to run into my fingers. We love you. I do this. All right, you guys. He thinks that I'm going to boop him. <laughs> he thinks you're going to boop him? Don't boop him. He doesn't like boops. So we're, uh, so we missed our lesson on Monday, but we're going to make it up later this week. Today's Wednesday, so <laughs> we're making it up soon. Oh my goodness. It's snowed in the arena, just like our arena, which is odd because this is an inside wall. This is the one she's riding in her lesson. We brought the big stool. We brought the big stool for the big guy. If I get on with that little tiny stool, my leg will be all the way up here. Yeah, I know. I can't get I on. I can barely get on with that. And I don't think it's good to get on with a little tiny stool. I, I get you to hold the stirrup just so I don't yank them. Yeah, back. I know. We're like extra mindful of their backs. Like you can ground mount or you can get on with a low stool, but it makes us nervous. Like if once I'm, you start paying all the bills and once you start seeing like something that you love be in pain because of something you've done. I wouldn't even be able to get on with that little stool. Yeah, then you stop doing like all the fun things like ground mounting. Not that we could ever ground mount. Gabby can. I'm choking. And all the like getting on with a small stool. No, your mane needs to be cut, yeah. He's like, oh, hello, girl. Hello. Are you riding me today? Let's bond. She doesn't get love you. You don't make me jump. Yeah. And you barely had any leg. Yeah, it'll be a while before so if he gets this boy jumping. Gabby will still ride him too. Gabby still loves him. I know some people think she doesn't. And I still love my pony. Yeah. And I think a lot of it's because there are so many different personalities on our channel and we misrepresent things by mistake, by accident. Like there's so many things that you guys don't get to see and hear that if we shared with you, you'd be like, wow, I didn't know that. The only reason why I'm riding Chino is because He's teaching you new skills. I had to breathe for a sec. I'm oh. telling them. Oh, sorry. Shh, don't pretend you didn't hear that. It's because he's teaching me how to teach Finn how to frame, and it worked last time. Yeah. Last time I heard Finn. Yeah. 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 And also, I want to tell you guys, because we get new people on our channel all the time, that we understand that our kids are beginner riders, that they're learning and growing and figuring things out. And that in the end, most of the time, with all people learning, horses take up the slack. They, they suffer for it. They're the ones who get the sore backs and the sore necks and the sore everything. So, and, and even if you don't think you're doing that, it's still, it still, it does. Like, it does. Even, like, professional people have to maintain their horse because of mistakes that they make. You can't be perfect all the time. You can't, we're never perfect. That's why we have chiropractor and massage for our horses every single month because we want to be able to reset and keep our horses maintained while we're making those mistakes. We don't want to just like say, too bad, shove you out into the field after we're done. We want them to feel comfortable always. And so we try and make sure that they get what they need. All right, so we're just waiting for Brandon. Girls are tacking up and Sam's making grain and then we're gonna get our ride on. I'm so excited. It's been like, this is, we haven't seen our horses for four days. All right. I think someone's a little fresh today. Yeah, someone is a little fresh today, but he settles down under saddle really good. Oh, Chino, stop. You are being a butt. Chino. Right. <laughs> she is up and ready. And Chino does settle down under saddle. But he, like, we didn't ride them for four days. Change the bit. And I think maybe he's noticing that right now. So what bit did we change from, Brandon? We changed from a miler. We changed from a miler yeah. to a snaffle. I don't think this is a snaffle. Yeah, it should just be a plain snaffle. Uh, we think it's I a plain think it is. Why? Because it's a bit. It's a D-ring. Mm -hmm. Right, so it's a D-ring, Gabby says, but it locks in the middle. So Do you want jump boots on them? Do you want jump boots on, Finn? 
Like one thing I don't think people see about this horse is how sweet he is and how like he just wants love. <laughs> Hold on Gabby, he's got the ears. Oh yeah. That's Yeah. Jumping jacks, running. I don't really think he actually really cares about that much. No. He just pretends to be afraid. Well, I think he's yeah, just. He, he literally hit the flowers and then he spooked at it. Oh. Yeah, like he's touched flowers today more than once and hasn't even cared. And you guys know flowers are scary. But he's just enjoying this. Do you feel better now that you had like a hands on, he was showing you what to do lesson? Yeah, yeah it helps. It helps. Sometimes you got to just take a step back. Look at how, how Finn looks different to me today. All right, is that better? You guys, is this better? Not as, not as um, much of an eye sore, but it's big. This is big for him. We are all adjusted. He's all locked down. That'll keep you warm. It's supposed to go down to minus 20, 22 or something. It's supposed to get really cold. So we readjusted, we got him a new neck. Got him a better neck, a warmer neck. You'll like it, Finny Finn. I'm trying to hurry up and get so home. All right, I'm trying to hurry up and get home so I can ride my horse. We are done. We're done. We're done, horses. Hold on. Uh oh, oh, there's a problem. There's a problem. The door wasn't open big enough for me to go through with him. And before I could stop him, yeah, I'm ruining Gabby's horse. Tino, don't make me look bad. All the ponies. Tino's like, I like you, ponies. He's like, I'll come and see you. <laughs> no, don't be doing that. You'll get me in trouble for sure. You want a pony? We got ponies. Tino's like, I see all the horses. He's a social boy, aren't you? You are. Tino's such a social horse. Look at the path the horses have made from the hay to the water. From the hay to the water. Good boy. All right, let's get this off you. We love you. We'll be back. Okay? Oh. He's like, okay, I'll go eat. <laughs> Bye, Finn. Bye, handsome. Be warm. Oh, he's going to roll. He wants to roll. Oh, my goodness. Chino's over there to see the pony. The Look how chunky you are, Finn. Look how fat he is! Do you guys know that every time your pony rolls... Oh, he doesn't like the neck. <laughs> Sylvia has an opportunity now. Oh, stay, stay, stay. Oh, you gotta go fix his blanket. Uh-oh. He's trying to get the neck off. That neck is not good. They're like. Oh, get the snow off. We don't want you all wet. Snow down your back. Oh, you silly boy. Right. Hopefully you guys are good. Yeah, his socks are so white in the snow. Going for a drink. This is the trek. This is the trek they take. I love just watching. I love just watching horses in their environment. Do you guys like that? There goes Chino. He's like, all right, we've had a roll. We've had a ride. Look at, they're actually playing in the snow, I feel like. All right, we are headed home. So, like, so many things, like, there's so much that happens, you guys. You guys know in your own life that there are things that happen. There's Stormy Boy. Look at him. Bye, Storm. <laughs> Bye. So uh, Brandon said that the same thing that happened to Penny yesterday, her feet got frozen, <laughs> happened to other horses at that barn, at his barn. But literally, her feet got frozen yesterday, and I was freaking out. I was like, oh, my gosh. What's wrong? Even though I kind of knew, but I'm still freaking out. She recovered so fast. So 
today uh brandon says it was just weird like weather just a weird thing that happened but today i'm gonna try and recoup my losses because it's supposed to freeze rain hey be nice to those ponies and i like already see grass outside and um i, I see all these people on instagram riding in their winter you want to ride penny pickle you want to do it yeah she's like okay laura <sighs> she said <laughs> so Hopefully, the next footage you see is me riding in the snow. Hello, how'd you do? I'm not broken, I'm just split in two. Hope you're fine, ain't got time to do everything you said you would. Frames of the past and the memory of you just come running by. Pictures of sunny days. With your smile in the bar How could they say I was broken? How could they say you made me come undone? Now I know that it's okay Unlike my friends, you are nothing like them oh. How could they say I was broken? How could they say you made me come undone? Now I know that it's okay Don't you know that you're beautiful? 